Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Tanner here and welcome to a new Ninjago video here on the channel. In today's video, we are going to be taking a look at what Nia's new powers might be looking like in the upcoming Season 15 storyline for Ninjago and what evidence we have to base these opinions or just assumptions off of. So obviously with the new information brought to us by several of the leaked Season 15 set images, we have a lot to talk about. Now with these images, once again, as I stated in my previous videos, I cannot show these pretty much anywhere, so sorry about that. I'm not legally able to distribute these images out to you guys and I do apologize for that once again but I do want to discuss a few things that are related to these set images that we have actually been speculating on for a long time one of which being Nia's powers expanded in season 15. The element of water is said to be expanding quite a bit in the upcoming seasons and I believe we might have just gotten our first look as to what that means. In the season 15 sets as I mentioned in a previous video as well the ninja suits this time around appear to be mainly diver inspired with oxygen masks and goggles and air tanks all the like they are basically glorified divers, so uh, all of the ninja utilize these except for a couple of ninja, those of course being Zane and Nia. From what we can see from the season 15 sets, these two appear to be just in their casual ninja suits underwater, which is intriguing to think about. Then again, when you take a look at Zane, it kind of makes sense. Zane really doesn't need oxygen. He's been through space. He's been underwater before in past seasons. He doesn't short out or anything. He's just able to breathe underwater normally because he doesn't breathe. He's a nintroid. He he doesn't need oxygen. So Zane's case, yeah, I could definitely see why he would not be using one of these diver suits. With Nia, I feel like it's because she'll finally gain the ability to breathe underwater, which is kind of crazy. But then when you think about it, she is a water ninja. She is the elemental master of water. They probably should be able to breathe underwater. We know that Maya will be coming back as well in season 15, that of course being Nia's mother, and perhaps she can teach her the ways of surviving underwater without the need for an oxygen tank or a mask or anything like that. It would only make sense in my opinion. We've seen it with other themes before, such as Bionicle, the water character being able to breathe underwater naturally, that should go without saying. But with Nia, it's never been seen before. That aspect of her powers has never been utilized before, so I feel like this is a really major step forward. We've seen Nia kind of toy with her powers in previous seasons and try to unlock some new abilities, try to understand her element a little farther, and I believe in season 15 we will totally be seeing that. I, for one, am really excited to see what this means, and if Nia will actually be breathing underwater, then that's awesome. I'm really excited to see how that power is actually utilized in the show. Will she still be able to talk or what will the fighting look like underwater when Nia herself is surrounded by her pure element? I'm excited to see what season 15 has to offer and I'm sure you guys can tell there's going to be a lot of season 15 videos coming out on this channel very soon. I have a lot to say. I've got a lot written down, a lot to talk about. So hopefully you guys are excited for that and hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. That'll pretty much do it for my thoughts on this subject. Let me know down below in the comments what you think. Do you feel like Nia will be able to breathe underwater starting with season 15 and what do you think that could look like in the show. Leave all your thoughts down below and hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and check out the links down below in the description for my other forms of social media. As always, big shout out goes out to my Patreon supporters, including once again the Marvelous Jan. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Once again, my name is Tanner Fishies, and with that, I bid you farewell. Mm -hmm.